let me catch you guys up to speed. In 2019, five years ago, this khaki map I made here, I built this map. You start with a lot of boosters and then you have a minefield of blocks. Your car bounces in random directions, but you want to get a bounce that takes you into the finish block up here. In the same khaki, someone else, I think it was Drarker, yeah, it was Drarker, made this map. Where what you do is you crash the car and get it to clip inside the finish from above. They were pretty simple. One trick and done. No, no advanced stuff, but still you had to like, see, look at this. Bug into the finish with the back wheel to make it count. Someone took these two maps and merged them. They made one khaki map out of these two and put it in a new event that's currently ongoing called Khaki Remix. So this is the remake. We've already finished the um, the original map that I made. So this map was one of the hardest, most random, and they found out if you just press up at 087, you win. I unplugged my joystick in case it has any drift, which is causing the car to steer. That would be unlikely, because I don't think it does, but I don't want that to ruin it. Lord heavens. I don't want it. If it's it, I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want it. Sorry, that was stupid. Okay. That's at least proof of concept, alright? But you can see- Carrot to our biggest AI streamer, Anedi. It has some similar features. You drive on a minefield. The thing that I don't like about this map is, is it makes me feel bad at the game though. I need to keep 310 speed to get across the minefield. Okay, and then bug into the finish. Boom. It moved. That's progress. The car was like trying to get through. Does holding forward make you faster while having engine off or is it placebo? Placebo and habits, but on some maps it, it matters. We are uh, moments away from posting the, the khaki mixtape. It is two hours of khaki songs. I cannot think of many other communities and games where, where it's like a staple now. Last khaki, they were over, <laughs> over uh, I think a hundred songs. And you know, some of them have no musical background or talent whatsoever, but many and most actually from actual, you know, low-key musicians who want to share something cool. Is it rude to say that? I feel like many, many khaki artists had the spirit, they had the energy. It's like your friend that goes up to the karaoke, takes the microphone, sings full of passion from their heart, but does not hit a single note. But you still love them for, for, for bringing the vibes. I do actually like this more and more now, because I'm seeing steering helps a lot. Just steering back and forth a little bit the car stays way more stable. If it was just press forward and hope, it would be a bit boring. <gasps> You're convinced this is impossible, and yet like 200 people have done it. Is NASCAR or F1 a better viewing experience? I mean, they both kind of suck. NASCAR, I mean, it's the same turn. F1, it's the same guy winning everything. Different motorsport, different problems. If you remove Max from F1, it's suddenly entertaining. Actually just went to a NASCAR race in Arizona and I managed to fall asleep with V8 engines blaring around. <laughs> <laughs> Average NASCAR fan. You know what I think NASCAR needs? Better car skins. When I look at NASCAR, I just see a bunch of ads. But why not give the cars cool designs like Lightning McQueen? And then the one time something interesting happened in NASCAR with the guy that drove on the side rail, like he, he hugged, he did a wall hug for speed and qualified. The one time, the one time something interesting happened, they were like, nope, not allowed. <laughs> Soft EP got him. No wall banks allowed. Do you think you can beat the AI task on the third map? If you're talking about the pipes, uh, there's no real point in trying. Like, the, the things it does is not things that are humanly possible whatsoever. With with any approximation. But it's kind of like developing, like, a huge mechanical robot with the punching strength of 10 Mike Tysons. And then putting it against the best boxer in the world. And, you know, putting them in a fight. Like, it's not a, it's not a good fight, we win! Not against the AI, but on the remake of my own map. Nice. Uh, did I enjoy this more than my own map? Oh, I think they're both terrible. Th this map and my own map both 
awful maps, honestly. That's what I think. If you start with a terrible idea and you remake it and you polish it, it's still gonna be a terrible idea. A good example of this is if you take the snow car from 2003 and you put it into the new game, it is still the snow car. Uh, there's one more map of mine which was remade. We gotta go back to, um, to YouTube to show you guys this. This is Young Virtual. Hardest map I ever validated. Not wrong, not clickbait. Real, real title. Imagine playing two hands on the mouse. Isn't there a VOD of Muda like winning a full speed match playing on mouse? So this is the map. Dude, I swear. <laughs> Go! Young me. Like four years ago. <gasps> Very happy. This took me 20 hours. This bounce is insanely difficult. Look at this. You have to hit the exact top of this sign to bounce up, go collect the checkpoint, but not go too high, and then land back down. And then, on top of that, this is combined with a map from BCP. This map took several weeks to be finished for the first time, because the trick you have to do is really difficult. You have to do a great speed slide to get enough speed that you can jump and land on this single railing. And then from here, you just go backwards all the way to the finish. And then you jump into the finish from here. So you have these two really difficult maps combined. And apparently someone finished this map within five minutes. Like this might be the least accurate spirit of the two maps that we just showed remake of all time. You cannot take a map I spent 20 hours on. And a map BCP spent a lot of time on as well, and and everyone who tried this map, and then make it finishable in in five minutes. We're gonna see how difficult it is. So you have his speed slide in the start, followed by a jump here to that platform, and then there's my bounce. So I think you need like 490 speed here. Oh, you need the purple purple turbo for ultra turbo. And maybe a nose down there. Onto the booster. Yeah, see, now this is a lot of speed. Ah, I still clipped. You made your old maps harder? No, the, the people have remade my maps and made them significantly easier. But maybe that's not a bad thing. If you guys have played Khaki Remix, have you found the easier Khaki maps more fun? There, There is a limit where it's like, very few people bother if it's too difficult. Think Dark Souls, but not Dark Souls no-hit run. Where did you get that hoodie? Uh, I don't know. I've had it for so long, but it's uh, it's only a plain color. Should be pretty easy to find. Guys, you gotta tell me if I'm weird for this. My sister thought it was super funny. There are some pieces of clothing, like a t-shirt or a sweater that I own two of of the exact same, like, pattern and design because I am scared of losing the first one. <laughs> Is that weird? Also, I think... No, we flew so far. Like, what if I lose the first one? What if I get a ketchup stain on the first one? I, I don't think it's that weird. It's just, like... Simplify your wardrobe. Get, like, two of the thing you like instead of 20 unique things. And then you can get away with wearing the same shirt two days in a row as well. Actually, I'm curious. I'm curious. Can you send me a picture of the coolest piece of clothing you own? The coolest t-shirt or the coolest pants or the coolest sweater or jacket or something that you have that you think is really cool? I once asked, like, there was once a guy who roasted my shirt on stream and I said, yeah, what are you wearing? And then he sent me a picture and the guy was wearing a really sick shirt and I just didn't know what to say. He had drip. Okay, wait, this is... A sick shirt. Okay, I'm full, of, I'm full of a few. This is the drip I was just sent. A Kanye West shirt. And I'm not I'm not sure if this is official or not, but it looks like a prank. Then someone sent this. I really like this. This is cool. And fun and cute. It has good energy. And it's like a nice sweater slash jacket overall, but you have the the thing to, to tone it down a little bit. This is not nice. I think... Deve sent this. Do not wear this in public. You will get hit by someone. This jacket looks really cool. I, I, I like it. I do not own any leather jacket like this, but hell yeah. Also, I think it's unfair. 
I think it's unfair that people look cooler when smoking cigarettes. I've thought about it in movies, in media, in videos, in pictures. It's annoying. This shirt is so sick. <laughs> Tupaca. I'm feeling inspired. I need to get something cool. Let's see if I can match the drip. The other day I was at the climbing gym and there was a girl who was climbing and she had a t-shirt like in the in the New York I love New York font. It said I love hot dads. And I happen to own a t-shirt, which has the writing, I love hot moms on it. I think it's meant to be, but am I gonna show up to the climbing gym wearing my I love hot moms t-shirt? Not happening. <laughs> Absolutely not happening. Live a little. Is it really, is that when you feel the most alive? When you get weird champed by everyone you walk past at the gym? Are you guys saying I have to do it now? can go next to it? Aha! Uh -huh. Scenario, she thinks you saw her t-shirt and then bought one to copy. Hmm, you're, you're actually right. Besides, it's, it's like... Okay, first of all, how many people own a t-shirt like that? Second of all, how many people go climbing in a t-shirt like that? It is not sportswear. You should walk up to her, tell her the shirt is really inappropriate and call security. That is that is mad riz. No, not the side. Security. We have a big problem. This map is far too easy. They have stolen my map and desecrated it. H how many times easier was this map than my original? If it took me 18 minutes while looking at a couple of t-shirts. Watch Techies run, yeah, we should check. He probably just got a better landing. Because my speed slot was 496, like he's not beating that. No, no. World record start. Oh, what? That's an insane run. Holy! Top corner getting the reset and landing with speed. I rate this remake a 0 out of 10, and I rate the other one probably like a 3 out of 10, but it's hard when the map was already bad. But I think it's cool. A lot of people are enjoying this event. Maybe, maybe as long as just like Khaki gets a little easier in general, maybe that's what we should aim for. But I think we should, should use new maps.